This is a pod of killer whales trying to sink a boat. It's a horrifying sight, but more horrifying is that killer whales worldwide have started to attack ships wherever they spot them. Three boats have met their fate, and around 505 attacks are reported. Since 2020, when this behavior of orcas was first observed, but the real question is, why are they attacking boats and how far they'll go in doing so? Historically, orcas have had a reputation as gentle and intelligent marine creatures, known for their complex social structures and awe-inspiring hunting techniques. They are known to not attack humans or to see them as a potential threat. The only known attacks from orcas toward humans are reported mostly from the ones in captivity. However, in recent years, an increasing number of incidents have been reported where orcas have actively targeted and damaged boats. This trend has perplexed marine scientists and prompted in-depth investigations into the root causes of such behavior. Take this pod, for example. A pod in the Strait of Gibraltar has sunk three boats and damaged dozens of others. Attacking boats off the coast of Spain, three boats have been sunk by these orcas, leaving the people on the boat astray. When they spot the boat, they go straight for the rudder, biting it just so the passengers can't steer the boat. There are two reasons given by marine biologists that explain what may be the reason behind this behavior of orcas. First is trauma. Maybe one of the orcas who had a bad experience with the rudder of a boat got stuck or hit by it. And now teaching other members of the pod to attack where they spot it, like they start seeing the rudders as a threat. A behavior induced by an aversive incident, and therefore a precautionary behavior. Given a single matriarch orca, White Gladys, appears to have started these interactions, it has been suggested a prior injury or entanglement could have led her to act. Does that make it revenge? Another reason they give is a fad behavior, which is a behavior initiated by one or two individuals that are then picked up by a couple more, and then they eventually abandon it. Orcas are known to follow specific behavioral patterns just like trends, just like in the past, orcas were seen wearing a dead salmon on their head like a hat, and other orcas adopted the trend too. But after six weeks, they abandoned it. Another potential explanation lies in the curious and playful nature of orcas. They are renowned for their inquisitiveness and often engage in interactive behaviors. It is conceivable that in some instances, their interactions with boats are driven by curiosity and an innate desire to explore new stimuli. However, their powerful and playful nature can inadvertently lead to damage to the vessels. In conclusion, the emergence of orcas sinking boats represents a fascinating and alarming shift in their behavior, leaving researchers and enthusiasts searching for answers. The complex interplay of factors such as misidentification, curiosity, environmental changes, and human impact likely contribute to this phenomenon.